Germany has one of the lowest birth rates in Europe. With an average of 1.3 children per woman, the country is rapidly ageing. The fact that Germany is viewed by many as hostile to children certainly doesn't help. 75% of Germans believe that their country is not child-friendly. To change this mentality and so boost the birth rate, a group of media organisations and ad agencies have launched a 30 million euro ad campaign. The demographics in Germany today mean that we just don't have many children in our society. The birth rate is so low that you hardly see children, and their presence in public life is minimal. And it's young German mothers who often feel most excluded. Rather than going to cafes or restaurants which are not always welcoming to children, many resort to places which specially cater to young families, such as this cafe in Berlin. People are no longer used to children and the noise they make. But the main problem for the mothers is that they feel excluded in the workplace. When I told my employers that I was pregnant, they asked me if I really wanted to keep the baby. I think that things really need to change in the workplace. In Germany, it's still unusual for very young children to be placed into nursery care, and mothers often stop work for the first three years to look after the child. Faced with the choice of giving up work, 35% of female graduates opt to never have children at all. In Germany, it's still very difficult to combine a modern work life with a family, which is why more and more young people decide to pursue their career rather than have children. New measures have been introduced, such as the parental allowance to guarantee an income during maternity leave, and more creches have also been promised, but the birth rate has not yet increased. But all these measures will only work if we realize that children are an integral part of our society. This is what we want to achieve with our campaign. An ad campaign is unlikely to boost the birth rate, but the issue is urgent. Otherwise, by 2050, the country's population could have shrunk from 82 million to 75 million.